guys, it's Ryzen51 here, your Angel Light. We are back for more Let's Play Mario Party 6. Today we're going to be on Egad's Garage. Uh, this is pretty much just like Towering Treetop. First one to get to the star, uh, just pay out 20 coins, and then the star moves to another location. So it's about the same routine, just new twists on this board. Let's see what this board has in store for us. Okay, our first star is going to be right there. Okay. No sweat. Okay, Egan's Garage. This is... Uh, I want to say this is my second favorite board out of them all. This is my number two favorite overall. Okay, so let's hit start. Not bad. You do get to... We get to be uh, introduced to a few new orbs in this game. Oh, well, on this sport, technically. Okay, so the ones we've seen so far uh, were the same ones originally. Alright, Luigi's off. Kotobu Orb as a new one we haven't seen yet. Okay, so. Whoever crosses the uh, Podobu Orb, you lose 10 coins. That's pretty much it. Alright, we're gonna play a little tricky tires. Okay. Avoid obstacles and race to the goal in your six wheel vehicle. Reach the goal first to win. Uh, control stick for left tire and the C stick for the right tires. Tilt both the control stick and C stick to steer your vehicle. Tilt both upwards to move forward. So this seems pretty easy. Just gotta go through this obstacle course. Yeah, I get cool blue. Uh, yeah, that's better. Uh, come on. Gotta move, move, move. Luigi wins the first one. Damn. Wario can't get in my way every time. <laughs> he wouldn't move. Ugh. He was stuck, I think. Alright, so hopefully I'm sure you guys are having a good Tuesday. <laughs> oh, that was actually cute. Some little ducks going around that water. <laughs> oh, yes. This happening space. Uh, this hat basically will send you back down here, but it will award you with a few extra coins as well. That's a little gift. Save for later. Two. Ah, blue space. See the one. Yeah, let's go up. Whew! So this day, yesterday was a little nuts because yesterday, as soon as we got home, Apparently, oh wow, already chance time? Kind of early. Anyway, while this is going on, uh, unfortunately, uh, when we got home, apparently our water was out, but somehow we forgot to pay the bill. Some, it, it's some weird coincidence, but uh, whatever happened, we mainly got it taken care of. So overall, we finally got the water. We had to go back out to the... Wow, best chess Sam ever. No stars at all. <laughs> Fortunately, uh, yeah, so we had to go back out to the gas station and get a couple jugs of water just to last. Yeah, it wasn't that bad, but not being able to do the dishes or, well, someone had to take a shower one night, that did kind of, that was kind of a bus kill. And most of us drink water and not soda anymore. So, yeah, that did, uh, that was a little tough for us. But, still, we got our water back on, so that's 
all that matters, so that's good to hear. Okay, we're playing Odd Card Out. I don't think we played this one either. Find a card that's different than the others and press the correct button first to earn a point. Oh, but, but first, earn a point. Earn two points to win. B, A, or X to choose a card. If you answer incorrectly, a thwomp will fall on your head. You'll lose a turn. Technically, this game is pretty easy. This is really easy. But some of them can be a little tricky. Alright, that was easy. That was only, there was only one Koopa with his eyes closed. Alright, one more to go. Wow, that was a little tricky. Oh, I see it now, the fuse. <laughs> I kind of guessed, I didn't notice this fuse was turned around. <laughs> oh, that tricked me. Alright, second place, good. And I'm guaranteed to get a star as well. And with my mushroom orb, I might have a good chance. Depending on where I can get that star. <laughs> or just going back. <laughs> but he gets. Dang it, eight coins. Lucky. So he just took first place. Oh, it's all the way over there, which means I have to go. Wow, I have to go a long way just to go to that star. Ah, I'll save it. Wow, two again? Really? What's with the twos, man? <laughs> right, Boost place a Google orb. And, wow, you guys get a lot of points out of all, all these orbs. Jiminy Christmas. Oh yeah, those those there are teleporters. They'll teleport you to a another area. I think it just teleports you to another teleport. That's about it. Oh, there goes Luigi down the pipe. Do another pipe. <laughs> I love that. Rats! Got nine coins out of that. Shoot. I'm gonna play a little pokey punch out. Very nice. This is a really fun and easy game. Punch and kick pokies that merge and sand to score points. So the scores the most points wins. Move, jump, punch, A, B to kick. Attack a pokey set its hop away completely and earn points for every one of its segments. And I might not have a refresher on we actually done these mini games one at once, so uh, forgive me on that guys. Oh yeah, my friend, uh, St. Louis Rocker, from what I heard. Well, I actually won't spoil it. But, uh, well, he, my friend is, my friend, uh, St. Louis Rocker is gonna go out on vacation, so, with his family, so, I'm gonna be wishing him a safe and happy trip. Please do as well. Alright, 29, not bad. Could, oh, yeah. I could have done better, but, uh, eh, it'll work. Ugh. And I'm in first. Oh, tie for first. Oh, wow. Okay. Okay, so here's what happens during nighttime. Now the bridge switches over. Yes, that. Uh, you can trade your orbs in that machine to get new orbs. For nighttime, you can trade your orbs for more coins. So that can be pretty useful. Now, is it over where I can get to it? Yes, it is. Excellent. Alright, let's go for a big number. Well, I need... 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6... I need 8. Okay. Really? Oh, come on! A 3? Well, at least I keep Wario from getting to the star now. <laughs> We won't get three coins out of that. <laughs> ah. So we're not in star position at all. Okay. Super 
shroom. Oh, there's another port teleporter there. Yeah, that's, that's another thing. We can't let Luigi get to it either. He's only four away. Great, which means we gotta get a big number and hope Luigi doesn't get enough to get to that, uh, to get to that first star. <laughs> Eh, if he does, that's no big deal. I remember we played this one. At least I remember one. <laughs> I think we might have a bit of an advantage, since we were a little faster. Yep, no problem. That was easy. Good job, Boo. You were a big help. Boo got boosted up to second place because of that, so that's good. The only miracle we have is what Wario. Yes, he did. That. Oh, it doesn't work though. You have to be with uh, that person on the uh, conveyor belt. Ah, makes sense. Ooh, big ten. Nice. Ah, so close. Luigi's only three or four spaces away. Well, Boo's gonna attempt it. Uh oh. Boo's gonna try and see if he can steal the star from all of us. <laughs> Oh, that's good. Ah, that's decent. 16. Ooh, lost 10. Well, it didn't matter. Oh. He's gonna be one space short. Oh, oh Boo is so close. Right, Luigi, low number. Dant. Oh, you got the first star. Bravo, Luigi. Kudos, my friend. You've earned that star. Scallion. Okay, next star is over here. Okay. Let's move out. Oh, yeah, I was actually watching. Uh, <laughs> I just noticed it on my uh, YouTube page, the homepage. I noticed a Super Mario Sunshine Versus. So I was saying, like, you know, that might, be that might be actually pretty fun to watch. So I checked it out and. I noticed Josh Jepson was on there, and I'm like, oh sweet, I gotta watch it now. <laughs> okay, I think, I don't know if we played this yet. Team up with a partner and run along the wheels to match the symbols at the top of the screen. Earn three points to win. B to spin the wheel forward, A to spin it back. Press the buttons carefully to make the wheel stop exactly where you want it to. Yeah, whatever they show in the picture here, or what Lack is showing. Come on, Boo. Yes. Yeah, make sure they match for a couple seconds. Nice. Got one more to go. Boo. Nice. Alright, good save, good save. Nice shot, Boo. You and I make a good team. I'll have to remember partnering, you, partnering, uh, be partners with you next time. Oh, I'm at 64. Safe base. <laughs> so anyway, yeah, I actually watched, uh, I think I'm on part six now of their Super Mario Sunshine Versus. They've done this uh, a year ago, almost a year ago. Okay, that was the Metal Mushroom. That one can be useful against trap orbs. So if you have the Metal sh Mushroom on, you come to a trap, uh, you can counter the trap and you will be safe. So yeah, Metal Mushrooms are kind of your your counter, your, ca your counter item against uh, traps. 
Koopa Troopa Orb. Uh, that one, if you pass by it, it will send you to a random air, a random uh, area of the, of the board. So that will just move you somewhere else. So that's not much of a big deal. Wow, we got a lot of two versus two lately. San Luigi. Jump the gun, okay. Alright. Oh, I think we did show this now. Yeah. Jump the gun? Yeah, I think so. Okay, so I'm shooting. But I didn't explain the rules to this. Simply just, uh, if you're shooting, uh, just try to keep a distance for your players. Okay, that wasn't smart. Just keep a distance for your players so they jump. And uh, for the players, just try to jump the bullet bills and make it to the uh, to the end here. Dan, I will say Luigi. <laughs> good on the mini games so far. I make a good progress. At the daytime. So the bridge is gonna go back the way it was. And orbs are random orbs. <laughs> yeah, it's only good to use that uh that uh orb when you're near a trap. It's only good when to use it there. Sure, I'll use mushroom. Yay, two points. There we go. That wow, that's more like it. 19. That's why I need it. Just what they need it. Woohoo! Ah, Bomb Bomb Orb. Nice. Uh that one I will use 20 coins for that. Wow. I have more than enough. And I got my first star. Nice. Next star is way over here. See how it and what's that? Oh wow, it's gonna be 15 to Oh one space away for one space too many for DK. Darn it. Uh yeah, it's gonna Kamek Orb. Oh darn it, that was a camp. Oh wait, I don't have any. Sorry, Kamek. Yeah, yeah. Who's been using a lot of orbs lately? He could have a chance at the orb star at the moment. Uh oh, there he goes. <laughs> I feel like it's five points out of it. Luigi, having stars would be really interesting. Oh, come on. Dude. Four player minigame. Okay, yes. Oh, yeah, uh, Josh Jepson was playing against, uh, Attacking Toucans. That's what it was, yeah, Attacking Toucans. I forgot the name. Oh, whoops, sorry, I forgot to read the directions for this. So all you really need to do is guide this chain shot through this obstacle course. That's why it says, throw me a bone. So that's about, you gotta throw him that bone through this obstacle course. If you run him into an obstacle though, he will be stunned for a couple seconds, just like uh, Boo did right there. So try not to let that happen. But overall, this game is pretty easy. Whoops, I think I screwed up. Yep. Come on, we'll go for a new record. Oh, come on. Can we... Yes! By one second. Woo! 1.05 milliseconds. Wow. Oh, there he goes. <laughs> oh, that's so cool. Uh, sweet. Sweet, sweet, sweet. Alright. Or 
originally his trap. Activate my trap. Hodabu. With this effect, you lose 1,000 light points automatically. <laughs> wow. You know, the trap orbs kind of remind me of a Yu-Gi-Oh reference. That, that, that seems like a Yu-Gi-Oh reference right there. Trap orbs. Trap. When I think of trap, as in, you know, like, you know, traps are you Yeah, I've already said it a thousand, a hundred times already. I just want to say it. <laughs> Set my trap over here. Maybe Wario will be able to use his Mel Mushroom here, so it will show the effect off. Mushroom, nice. And obviously, if you land on your, if you go past your space with your trap orb, it obviously won't won't affect it. Now I should have got the metal mushroom because of that. <laughs> now that Boo laid a trap over there, I'm gonna regret it. I forgot, I forgot how sneaky Boo could be, because Boo is a real sneak in, this, in these games. See, look at this. He's got so many orb spaces at the moment. Or character spaces, so this is going to be a rough match. Uh oh. Battle minigame time. Sweet. 20. 80 coins are for grabs. Yeah, one more. Okay, guys, we're back. Sorry about that. Okay, so maybe we'll get this? Yes, good. A bounty we haven't tried out yet, so we're gonna play a little Insectoride. This is one of my indeed favorite uh, bounty games. Pick a locomotion machine and start racing. Clutter reaches the goal first wins. B A Y X L R just presses direct it. Press the button. I said buttons. <laughs> press, the, press the buttons that surrender to claim victory. Sheesh, I'm starting to sound like Scooby Doo now. <laughs> so we have a grasshopper, the beetle, snail, and ladybug. My advice: just choose the one that suits you. See, Grant. I think the easiest one to use is the ladybug. Maybe the snail. Maybe the beetle. Oh, good. I didn't get the beetle. Sweet. Nice. Or, or why did I say beetle? I meant ladybug. Wow, I'm so dumb. <laughs> okay, so let me explain. The Oh, actually, I'll just do it here. The uh, grasshopper, you have to press all those buttons. Uh, the snail, you have to wait for his neck to his uh, head to extend. I think, um, just, uh, press it. Darn it. Ooh, that was close. I think it's it. Or right, the beetle, I think you have to press just a random button whatever comes up. And for the ladybug, you have to press one of the buttons ten times just to move on. But since I wasn't paying attention, that cost me first place. And I get all my money back. Sheesh. And Wario gets like four coins out of all of that. 